Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be showing you my planner lineup for 2019. I'm gonna first start off with this one right here, which is like buried under everything. There we go. My wedding planner. Oh, so excited. <laughs> So I will have a planner video, a wedding planner like setup video for you guys. I'll have that link down below if I haven't posted it already um, or if I have posted it already but I'm pretty sure when you guys are seeing this I haven't posted it yet. So when I do I will leave a link down below but also make sure you're subscribed or you hit that little bell to notify you whenever I post a new video so you guys don't miss this. I'm really happy with how this turned out and I can't wait to start planning in it. So this is my wedding planner and I just used the wedding extension pack and I have a ton of notebook paper but also I used a ton of these like pocket pages and things like that to put in a lot of fun little things so it's actually pretty thick I do have it on expander discs already and I have this hard cover here from the happy planner it's one of their like snap-in covers and it's got gold foil polka dots on it so it matches really good with these metal discs and yeah that is my planner my wedding planner for 2019 so this next one is my memory planner and just like the wedding planner I will have a video on this um, just talking a little bit about how I set it up and how it's going to be working for me and I'm super excited about this because I am going back into a classic size happy planner this year and as you can see I do have expander discs on it but it is looking mighty skinny and there is a reason behind that and I'm going to talk all about how I will be using this this year and I just wait so I do have this in a deluxe cover and I did use the daily details cover as well as the daily details inside I used all the dividers but then I took out the weekly so you guys will have to come back for that video as well but this is going to be my memory planner for 2019 and I just have like I said the pink deluxe cover on top there the next planner oh well, I guess this isn't really a planner but I wanted to show it to you guys just in case you do have this cover and you don't know what to do with it yet um if you're like me and I I loved all of my planner covers this year and my memory planner cover and my wedding planner cover and all my millions of planners I have so I decided to use this as a notebook cover and I just use these periwinkle discs that I actually got in the six pack of colorful discs that came out earlier this year from Joanne by the happy planner and I am just using it as a notebook so I've got all different kinds of note pages in here from the happy planner new releases old releases so this is going to come in handy i will i've actually already used this for like the last couple weeks because as soon as i got this i really wanted to make a notebook out of it because i thought it was like the perfect cover i love the copper and this is another reason why i kind of wanted to show it to you guys because if you're wondering what disc color to choose with this this blue or periwinkle whatever goes perfectly so i'm going to be grabbing for this a lot this year and by the way, if I keep on saying next year and this year in this video, it's because it's New Year's Eve when I'm filming this. So, Happy New Year! <laughs> Alright, my first classic planner I'm going to share with you is the Daily Details with the like mint green discs right here. And I am in love with this. I think it's so cute and so me. I just really, really love this. And I did some fun things with this planner and I'm going to do a setup for this and also my Healthy Hero Planner, which I'll show next. But this is just going to be my catch-all planner, and I franken planned this with the Coastal Planner. So make sure you stay tuned because I'll kind of show you how I did that. And if you guys have any, you know, questions or anything about franken planning, let me know in the comments of this video, and I'll be sure to answer that in my setup videos because I have not filmed those yet. So if you have any questions, let me know. But I did, I guess I should say, I did use all of the dividers. Just like my memory planner, I love this planner so much, so I wanted to incorporate that, or I wanted to use that in two different places this year. And I did use all the dividers from this planner because it is super cute. And somebody asked me a couple videos ago if they had a big size of this, and they do. And it kind of has like the lemon kind of design on it. So just make sure you look for that. I think it's a white cover though. And it's got some lemons on it. It's really cute if you like to plan in a big. Okay, my last classic size planner is this one right here. It's 
the Healthy Hero on the gold discs. And I love this cover with the gold discs. I think it just looks so pretty. So I'm actually gonna be using this for a couple different things. It's gonna be like a, a health and wellness and fitness and all of that. But also it's gonna be a social media planner because I really like the layout of this. Let me see here. Here's like this week. I already kind of started to write things down, but the layout is just really nice because if if you're like me and you've struggled with a fitness player planner in the in the past, I wanted, I guess, in all of the fitness planners I've used in the past that I've kind of stopped using randomly, I really wish that there was a spot that I could write like things that I needed to do for the day. So I like that this has a today section straight across and a focus section straight across, but also you could always cover these up because the food log will definitely be covered. It was covered this week, I covered it. And then the exercise, I wanted to keep it like that, but I might include wellness on there for the days that I'm not gonna be working out because I'm not gonna be working out seven days a week. I'm gonna be probably doing four to five. And so for those days off, I'm going to want to put something else. I might just do a an X, I guess, one day. Or I might write, like, go to bed early like I did. Well, I haven't wrote it yet, but that's what I'm going to write for Sunday this week. So I'm really liking this planner so far, but I will probably talk more about how it's working for me once I start using it, you know, this whole month. I'll probably do something, like, in February and tell you guys how I'm liking it. But I really like how you can track your water. I really like how it's all separated. And I just, I really like this planner. And the colors and the cover and everything is really pretty. And I really liked like this cover because it's not a super muscular fitness girl running or girl like playing sports because that's not me. I don't like to run. I don't like to play sports. So I like how she's just stretching and it just says I can and I will. And I think it's a perfect cover for a social media planner, also for a wellness and fitness planner. It's kind of like the best of both worlds. Even though I don't have brown hair, I just, I think this is so cute. I just really like it. So that is my health, wellness, and social media planner. And then last one is this one right here, which for the life of me, I cannot remember what this planner is called. So I'm going to put it up here at the top. And I am obsessed with this planner. I will actually show you guys how I planned this week. I did use the new Free Spirit sticker pack and that plans amazing in a mini, especially in a mini vertical. Look how cute that is. I really just wanted it to be a functional week and I'm obsessed. I think I found my like planner piece when it comes to a mini. I'm obsessed with the vertical layout. I just think this, for some reason, I like how it's, it's in three different blocks. And I also like, I feel like I have more room. I know that is not true, but for some reason to me, I feel like I have more room in here. And I just really like it. I also really like the sidebar. Let me show you what a blank week looks like. Isn't that so cute? I just, I love that. I also have the budget little extension pack in here as well. I do have this on classic size discs because this year I wanted to try something different and I wanted to do a chunkier mini and I'm really liking it so far. So make sure that you stay tuned for my setup of this because I will do a, a, just a quick video on how I set this up. So this year I'm actually trying something different. I really don't have a whole lot. That's why I'm gonna, I might do a setup video with all three because it'll be a really quick video, or I might do the two classics with the mini because I'm really going minimal this year with like decorating and putting in inserts because I really wanted to focus on the actual planner itself and not all like remembering to try to fill in all the inserts and things. So stay tuned for that. I will let you guys know if I, you know, what I decide to do for that. But I will of course do like a mid-year flip through or something or a mid-year setup and show you guys what's inside my planner and yeah. So those are my planners you guys. These are my three most used planners but then I do have my memory planner, my wedding planner and then if you want to count the notebook. But really let's just say I have five. I have five planners. 
that's not too bad because two of them I don't even use very often. So I'll stick with these three and they will work just fine with me for this year. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know in the comments below if you are using any of these planners and if you're not, which one are you using? I'd love to know in the comments below. Thank you again for watching and I will catch you guys in my next one. Bye. Happy New Year.